Hello, it's Ugly, and welcome back to another season of Hammerting. If you are enjoying the content on the channel, please like, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications. If we've already done that, then you're awesome. Thank you very much. So, time to start a new season. The old one, we did actually win, so I feel like I can I can say that one was done. We got a thousand gold in the big vault. It's good. Right. I'm learning a few things about this game already since the new expansion. I've never played the game in its current state from the beginning. So what I need to do is I'm going to lay down this. So I want a, I want elevators here and they're basically four wide. Yep, I want elevators here. Yep, I'm just thinking they're four wide. So I want to put, that's the one I put. The thing I always dig down. I always have like a, a, a scaffold next to elevators. And then, oh dear, that's some terrible. Yeah. So the, the elevator is going to be there, so I can put a. Um, oh, it's like a rail station now. It's not an elevator. I can put my quarry there. Cool. Right. So let's get on and do that. Uh, we don't need that. We don't need that. And we don't need that. We can put that in. That's not a big deal. Right. So first things first, we've got to build ourselves a small quarry. Try not to assign ourselves too many tasks, because I get complained about if I assign too many tasks to start with. People moan at me. <laughs> we should also, ah, cool, there's uh, copper over there. Once this is done, uh, okay, I'll send some people over to get copper. Come on, go over get them and get copper. Once they've done this, then we need to build some granite chunks here. So we'll get 20 granite chunks going. Just keep it, maintain 20 granite chunks. Someone should be over there to do that, hopefully. Yep, we're going to get 20 granite chunks on the construct. Oh, dwarves, why must you taunt me so? Right, let's see if there's any other dwarves we can get. Uh, what are you? Glutton Gambler Battle Scar. No. We're going to try and get good dwarves. But normally I completely compromise my goals to get good dwarves and go for absolute garbage dwarves. <laughs> garbage dwarf. Makes it sound really bad, doesn't it? The garbage dwarf. We're going to check out over here and check out over here as well. Okay, right. I'm going to make sure that these things are automated to go the way I want them to so just get select there and double click I want them to get this this stat eventually lots of good stats to get but that one's that path is awfully good right we've got I've uh, got a number of slimes up here hopefully these doors can fight off these slimes and it's good good to kill slimes because you get um green stuff and green stuff is good for the uh, purposes of um what is it good for healing potions right so I'm going to see if there's anything out over this way so I'm not going to say no to, don't say no to slimes, say yes to slimes, slimes are your friend. Right, let's go over here, see if there's anything else to be seen. Uh, that's a, a bunch of slimes, but we will not be confronting them just yet. Not quite yet. Right, so we've got this built, so when we get that built, we get the ability to make other things. So we're going to build like 20 of those. Three of, uh, what you should do is also... Put this to maintain the amount of building and inventory. So we're going to get 20 in there, 20 there, 20 of these, 20 of these. There you go. Right, just maintain that level of stuff. So accept an overworld mission, complete an overworld mission. Okay. Let's have a look at the overworld mission. What have we got then? These people. Right, so we want to... I'm not sure how we accept a mission. Um, it's not 100% clear how you do that. Um, fine. But as long as we've got that build, we should have enough. Right. I'm going to have to sort out trade sooner rather than later. Not quite sure. Acquire one. Increase the indicated value to the completed mission. Okay, to complete the mission. So we've just got to, we've just got to like sell these people some stuff. Okay, we'll sell them some granite then. 
Um, I'll sell like some granite to these people. I want to be a sales sales to start with because um, last time I did this, I tried to restart a minute ago, and they when I tried to buy from these people, they basically just went out there and never came back. They just stayed in this town, so I don't quite know what that's all about. Bit of a minor bug there. That's fine, we can sell these people. We won't make any money out of doing it. See what I mean? They're just staying there. Why are you just staying there? Maybe because they've got nothing to do in the town. That's probably a good idea. Okay, right, so let's assign them some stuff. It's weird because you think they would come back, but they, they kind of don't. Yeah, they right, okay, that makes sense. <laughs> right, acquire one trade level. Well, we've done that, so. Deliver one lantern. Okay, cool. All right. So we need to get our next level of stuff. So we need to get metallurgy so we can get copper ingots. And that gives us access to the next building, which is a foundry. All right, so we'll put in a foundry. Um, again, I'm going to just do it like this. Yep. Yeah. And then I'm going to put a foundry in here. Right. Foundry in there. Put some little blocks. Uh, blocks. Yep. Like that. Put some blocks in there. Cool. Cancel that. Don't want to build in that really. That was just a... A bit of a... An, a planning... One, two, three, four... Ah, there, right. So, discover God of the Forge. We're going to be doing that for a second. We've got a while to go. Probably won't do that the way things go. Okay. So, clearly, construct a large vault, fill it. You see, I never had that mission before. that is a lot of stuff fill it to the brim that's like 50,000 gold to do a large vault that's a lot of gold but hopefully we'll be like doing a lot of trading and stuff here so what have we got a dwarf there let's try and get, get a new dwarf because we need new ah oh, we got a choice of dwarves born of stone good bad Bolshevist laughter, omen. Um, I'll get you. Sense of humor. No, right. Gives us more dwarves anyway. Why aren't you building, you losers? What are you doing? Why are you storing them? What are they being. Oh, you're building chunks. Okay, right. Ah, oh, that's what I'm doing. All right, stop it. I, I clicked the wrong thing. My God. I hope you've been playing this game for how many months now? And you still make those mistakes. Shake my head in shame. <laughs> right, we need this foundry built. Come on, build some freaking... Right. We need these built more than we need crushed granite built. Right. I don't need that much crushed granite. No one needs that much crushed granite. And that, and that. Right. Hopefully, there we go, we're getting blocks soon. Alright, let's speed things up. We're still waiting on materials to do this, so obviously we need those, we need granite slabs, I think, to make these. Yep, granite slabs. Oh, it's granite chunks. It's always with the chunks. But all these chunks they've built are reserved for doing other things, so that's why they weren't actually building anything. It's always the way. I'm used to working with a slightly more developed economy. So, oh, what's that? A ruby crab. Get the ruby crab. No, we'll we'll be friends with the ruby crab to start with.
All right, nice. Um, so we bump into our first water. Oh dear, water. My old friend. We just got to crank this down a little bit. We don't need that many. We really don't need that many. We need these. We need slabs. And we need chunks that aren't dedicated to other things. <laughs> so I can start building this. Oh, there they go. Right. Uh, we also need coal. Get you mined. All right. Oh, we've got 18 mountain law. Let's get some more stuff doing. All right, we trade relations is crap, but that's fine. We need five trade. So we need to look at this. What do we need to do here to get this trade level up? We need to deliver a lantern. Okay, well, we'll make a lantern in a minute, but we need to learn some more. We need some blacksmithery to do that, I think. Yep, you need blacksmithery, which means you need 15 mountain knowledge, which we'll get shortly. I have no fear of that. Don't worry. Right. Let's build down. It's a common theme we're going to find, building down. That's fine. And also building up. Gotta build up. Gotta build down. Don't gotta build around. Right. That's good. So my plan, by the way, is a simple one, because I'm a simple man. Ooh, ooh. What I'm going to do is I'm going to like one, two, four. I've got to look at these buildings. Hold on. All right, so we're going to put farming underneath this. So we're going to one, two, three, four, five, six. So six that gives us double down. It's twelve. That's good. All right. I know I seem to be doing simple maths here, but I'm just working out how high the ceilings need to be to make it nice and spaced. All right. So let's build a K farm. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Is that the right way? Or do we do foundry height? We do foundry height. However high there is. One, two, three. We'll do it eight high then. Fuck it. Right. Uh, just try to work out where to put the first things in. It's always a difficult process. I'm going to put it there. I'm going to put 2k farms as well. I'm going to put in these stone walkways. Right. Nice. Right, so then we can start making stuff at the cave farm. Um, what we do need to make is energy and we'll get these sugar beets. Sugar beets are always good for energy. Right, let's get some sugar beets. A little bit more cave knowledge is required. Ugh, you see, I put that in the wrong place. Put it in the wrong damn place. Every time. It's going to be an elevator there. We can't do that. Right, kill that. Die, cave. Alright. Oh, God, we dumped two dwarves out onto the ground. That's always the way it goes. Right. And you, you can die as well. Cave, die. Right. The glorious mountain complex. We've only got 13 mountain law at the moment, so we need more mountain law than that. We need to make some copper bars as well. As a perpetual thing, we shall be doing... I'm, I'm only uh, doing it with one hand, because uh, I'm drinking. We've got... A, yeah, we've got a, right, 20 of those. Right. I want to start to 10. 
Nice. It's all good. All right, we got a new dwarf. They need a path to follow. There you go. There's the path for them to follow. Why is no one building? Build this. Give me some sort of priority, you losers. Oh, I've only actually got one dwarf that's not stranded. <laughs> that's why. Alright, let's see if there's any dwarves I can recruit that aren't. No, they're all really expensive now and I've got no money. Fine. So when we get some ore, which they will deliver soon. There we go. Alright. We need to put a cave farm in again and not actually screw it up this time. Right. Wonderful. And I'm okay, farm. And what we can do is we can sell our wonderful beetroots to the outside world. I'm sure they all love to buy them. Uh, we only need 10. Maintain 10 levels. Right. There's water over there. We don't need water at the moment, so that's fine. That's uh, small water bridge. Right. So I'm going to build two two houses, then leave a gap of four spaces so I can put a rail station in. That's the plan. Right. This is coming along. We need to get all this metal mined. Also, as always, we're going to put houses above the, the main place, so. I don't sweat the design. Things are, things are going to be like, I, what I'm going to try and do though, is I'm going to try and build this main hub deeper. That's the that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try and build the main hub deeper. So that's my objective this time. Build main hub deeper. Cause I don't want everything just by the entrance, because this map is massive. And I think I think the main hub should be more centralized. So I'm gonna try and do it slightly differently this time. in place what's it in place good right let's see what we can sell to these um overworld suckers hey overworld suckers is there anything you'd like to buy uh they want a lantern don't they we can't build lanterns yet because we do not have all right we've got the tree we've got the blacksmithing law to do it so let's get blacksmithing law and with blacksmithing comes a smithy of a small size so we're going to put in next to the no, can't put it in there. Why can't we put it in there? Hold on, let's check that again. Small smithy. Oh, I tried to put it in too close. Fine. Do that. Awesome. All right, so small smithy coming up. Not quite sure. Uh, I want to be able to go down there to get those, don't I? Hmm. Okay. Fine, let's speed things up. Like I say, I'm no mega speed player at this game. Right. But we need to get rid of some of this, don't we? Like this. Should we, if we do that, we should be able to get rid of all that and they should do it in a fairly intelligent way. Because they used to do it. They used to do it in a less intelligent way. But let's see if they can do it in a more intelligent way and actually get rid of it this time. As opposed to failing. Because they used to fail. Oh, they've done it. Good. <laughs> Yay. Right. And the same with this bit. So they shouldn't, like, rip everything out. 
like they should leave some chunks so they can actually get in there and finish the job but you know i wouldn't put it past them to screw it up because you know this is the dwarves and i've become accustomed to yeah they've screwed up oh doesn't matter doesn't matter dwarves you that's fine right keep on digging down The problem we have is some of the buildings are different lengths, which is a bit of a problem in my mind, but that's fine. Right, so we've got a smithy now, which means we want to buy, make a lamp. Ooh, a lantern is an explorer's lantern. Uh, I'll just buy a, a, make a lantern. There you go. Don't be too fussy about it, but a couple of lanterns. Maybe like 10. And we'll sell those to the uh, overworld. Once that's done, we've got loads of other stuff to make, but we're not gonna sweat it too much. I want to try and get some other materials before we get going on this. But I mean, you know, maybe we should, you know, early game mistake, do not build tools. I should not make early game mistake by not building tools. So I'm going to build the tools. I'm going to build some tools, even if they are shit tools. You know, five of those. Five of those, and then as soon as we can, make some miners' pickaxes. Right. Obviously, we need trade law. So once these uh, once these lanterns are made, we should sell these suckers. I mean, valuable valuable people sell them some lanterns. Uh, yeah, sell them some like lanterns. There we go. All right. get some trade law good we get trade law which means we get trade relations which is what we wanted really because that will give us the the stuff we need to um make houses which is what we're going to do now so we're going to make some houses because we've got some dwellings we've got to find some a good place to build some dwellings let's just check out if we can do it up here i just want to check along here sweet okay right so as always you've got to leave a gap of four Looking at the first dwelling, so we're going to need some wood because we definitely don't have wood. So we're going to buy some wood from these kind. These people got wood. Oh, oh buy. What have they got? No, have these people got wood. They got wood. I'm going to need five bits of lumber. Now these guys should be automatically replacing their hammers, all their uh, their pickaxes. I believe they will. Yep, automatically replacing their pickaxes, which is absolutely splendid. Right. For some bizarre reason, they only trade into um, stone chests. I don't understand why. I don't ask why. I just know that's what they do. So I'm going to uh, build a stone chest and, oh, and so that this stone chest can hold lumber. Now, a bit of luck, they should actually go off into the outside world and actually go and get some lumber now. Good. It's weird. I don't know why they do that, but that, that's just the way it works. This is the game, so... <laughs> Right, nice. So we're going to get five houses built. That's enough for our dwarves. Ah, sovereignty has gone up, which means ah, we um we must have um we must have uh, got a trade or a, a knowledge. I think we got this one. Foremost learn it gives us extra sovereignty. Yep, good, nice. Okay, right. So let's come on. I'm going to find somewhere to put my vaults. I don't know where a good place for a vault is. Always difficult to find a good place to stash your cash. Alright. Have I got stuff being built here? Yeah, sugar beet. 
and uh, shrooms. I'll make some shrooms. Let's maintain some shroom levels now, not mountain shrooms. Uh, yeah, just 10 and, and start at 5. Right, cool. Right, we've got this coming along. Good, more mountain lore. Just do that. All right. Got our first house. It's a sign of dwarf. Yep, I have, have an assignment. And you have a. Maybe you, you're more angry than the other dwarves. Okay, right. Let's get ready to build this out. Uh, this is going up. All right. When this house gets built, hopefully with a bit of luck, we will be able to. Uh... Well, there's no luck involved. We will put dwarves in it. Uh, I do need to build some more tools, though. No, I've got enough tools actually. I just need more dwarves. All right. Um. Ten of those. Ten of those, and ten of those. No, five. Oh, God. Right. I know they're shit, but whatever. So we do need to get our cooking skills so we can get our friend the meat cleaver. So let's get that doing. Uh, where is it? Advanced cooking. Cooking. Ah. All right. We need a bit more trade. We need a bit more cave law for that, but that's fine. That's an angry plant down there. What are we waiting for? Ingots. Ingots are being used up at the moment. Uh, we don't have a lot of metal, do we? Let's get that out. Oh, there's metal down there. They're just not smelting. It's been slow. Uh, I don't know if I can get to there or not. Maybe. I'll tell you what, we can easily facilitate that, though. No, they can't get there. No, no, they can get there. Okay. Cool. Right, so we are rushing towards automation. So we need ingots and we need... We need to basically just get this stuff built, really. Right. Uh, did we get the... Did we get the overworld map sorted out? So, make a blacksmith's hammer. So we need to get that made as well. So, uh, hammerhead, all right, five of those, or 10 of those, another 10 of those, and a black, not a cook's ladle, a blacksmith's hammer. There we go. Build 10 of those, gives us 10 more hammers. Good, all right. What's going on there? Oh, they're all they're all angry because they've got no um, they've got no greed. They've got no ways to satiate their greed because they don't have houses. But don't worry, they're, they'll be they'll be dealt with. Greedy dwarf, needy dwarf. Also, they they probably need that. Is that greed that needs to satiate? Probably. Our oh, morale's low. Morale is low. Energy, what have we got there? Energy, energy, morale. Oh, they need water. Okay, all right. Well, all right, if you need water, I will bake, I will make you some water. I will be gathering water later on, but I'm just going to make it for the time being because it just makes sure their morale stays high. Right. Or at least higher than it was, than it is at current, so... One, two, three, four, five, six. I've got a lot of tasks going on, but you know what? It's always pays to over queue things because otherwise the door's sitting around doing nothing. You don't want your door sitting around doing nothing. Uh uh. Waiting for lumber. If we've got no lumber, 
Let's go to the override and buy some more lumber then. Then what we need to buy, what's the mission? Buy lumber, oh good. They want beams, blocks of granite, oh they want loads of stuff, they want woodsman's axes. But they want me to buy more lumber, I could buy lumber, okay. Oh to be so poor, right, what are these people, we need to sell these people some stuff, what do they want, they want lanterns. There you go, have lanterns. Right, also. What you should do the job broker is you should check and see who's good at trading and who isn't good at trading and say right you can't trade you can't trade you two can trade because you want them to have good trade skills otherwise they'll sell for like i don't know they'll give people like i don't know they'll do bad deals they'll get bad deals and we don't want a bad deal oh no 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 no, no. but no bad deals right a bit of luck we should be getting some stuff. Yeah, money. And the more you trade with these people, see the trade levels going up. The more you trade, the more map you reveal, which is ideal for what for our purposes. Hopefully this guy will be like No. Not so keen on the old telling me anything or doing any trading stuff. Right, so let's get off. <laughs> Where are we going? We're heading towards this. So we need advanced casting and then machinery. Oh, actually, we're we're getting there. We need that though for the horizontalness. Still need that. Dwarf with low health. Right. So we've got a dwarf with moderately low health. So I think we've got um, arcane workshop. Yep. So we're gonna put an arcane workshop in. Right. So what are we doing here? These are like. One, two, three. Four, five. No, why am I counting it wrong? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, right, so these are six high. Okay, arcane workshop. Right. One, two, three, four, five, six. So right. we want it to go there. But not there. There. Alright, cool. Alright. Right, so. And the reason why we're doing that is because we want um we want to make bandages and stuff bandages bandages because we've got unhealthy dwarves so we need to heal those dwarves so whilst we have the raw materials to actually care for them like gauze and slime we don't actually have the why are you still waiting for lumber i've bought lumber hmm I'll be very specific. All right. You. Edit filter. What lumbers do you accept? Venderati lumber is what I want. Okay. And we'll just check out in the world. All right. Venderati lumber. All right. Bye. We'll just get these guys healed up first, though. That guy's getting angry because he's got no house. Because I can't get any wood. I'm just looking around if there's any mine carts. No, not so much. Don't get angry at me, dwarves. There you go, we've got one on the way. It's getting sorted, they're just being slow, right? Let's recruit dwarves, let's see what we got. Alright, we've got enough for you. Reach, uh, okay, but you know what? Oh, not enough coins. What are you like? Free spirit? Uh, that's alright, gambler, no. Emaciated, no. No, and no, right. Well, we've got another house built, so we need to assign another dwelling to another dwarf. All right, so we've got another house built. These houses are now getting built, which is nice. All right. How are we doing for trade and mountain law? We're doing all right. We need beams, though. The only way to make beams is to build them here. 
and we need to build them and I'm going to be specific about building that for copper ore and I want to maintain a level of like five because I don't want loads I don't need loads in the mountain so you want like 10 in the mountain in total and uh, yeah, there you go right so hopefully we'll get this built soon acquire 13 mountain law and make a workshop okay cool well we're going to make this workshop as soon as it's built these beams are built right there we go nice right let's build ourselves some oh god i've built an arcade workshop not medicine oh ugh medicine i need like a few more a little bit more exploration to do that that's fine we need to just explore some more all okay, right let's prioritize that get that done and we need to sell some more um, precious equipment, not garbage. Yeah, here we got our cleave axe heads as well, which means we should make cleavers, which is out of that. We should make like uh, 10 of those. And handles. And then uh, 10. I can't make like uh, I've got to build a cookhouse first, which I haven't done. So I've got to build a cookhouse. So I'll build it here. Uh, I'll build it here actually. Um, cookhouse. Um, we can't build a cookhouse yet. Do not have the technology, right? Okay, not a problem. I won't fall for the same mistake I I made before. I do need medicine. Medicine is more important than cooking, to be honest. Right. So I need a little bit more cave lore. Come on, caves. Give me some more lore. All right. Anything over here? Can we send someone over there to have a look? That would be awesome. Did we get a little bit more cave lore? We only need three points. Come on. One. Oh, it's another two points. Come on. Uh, 14. Splendid. Right. So let's build our medicine thing. Cool. And then build a medicine hut. Next to the infirmary. Yep, that kind of works. All right, cool. Oh, and then we can get these guys' heels up. And then we can think about trading with the, the outside world a little bit more. What do you people want? You click sign. What are your missions? You want grave poppies and jelly cake? Don't we all? Don't we all? New people want woodsman's axes and beams. Okay, well, we can do that. Granite and wood chunks, all right? Okay. All right. Oh, we've got a battle going on here. No, where's the battle going on? Maybe there isn't a battle going on. I just heard it just randomly. Cool. Right, we've got those deliveries going on. These dwarves are getting a bit rubber ducked. It's a technical term, I think, for what these dwarves are getting. Come on, you. Keep building. Verdant grow mushroom stew free silver ore. Okay. Oh, we've got plenty of metal and stuff. We just need to get rid of that. Cancel that because they ain't gonna do it. Uh, and the final dwarf goes in that house there. Alright, nice. Right. Hopefully once this is done. I've got to check this out. You got plenty of things, but they all reserve for stuff. No, you just I think I've just over I think the world I think they're just overwhelmed with um like stuff to do, so they're not getting it done. This needs to be prioritized, so let's give them a little bit more of a priority on that. I just want it done, that's all. Because then because like my dwarves are starting to get a bit ill. 
come on, come build. I'm gonna do it for gear anyway. You're all geared up. We haven't. We, okay, all right, that's fine. Oh, they're all gone. They're going to the outside world. Uh, some, some have. Could you prioritize this task that I've asked you to prioritize? Come on. Before you die, that'll be a good that'll be a good start. If you could maybe build the thing that lets you heal before you die. It's like, oh okay, we'll do that. Oh, good plan, Og. Yeah, yeah, thanks. No. <laughs> oh, just fuck yours is right. Are they, are they got, got, have they used all the gauzes up? We can buy gauzes. Let me just double check. Right, I think these people sold gauzes, didn't they? I bought uh, lichen and uh, uh, gauze. Uh, not for not very much, but we don't have a lot of money. But we shall gain some money by selling these people lamps. I do want a lot of copper. Lamps, that's what I need to do. Uh, also, I can sell some of these shitty... Sell all that, I want these. And sell all that, I want those. Right. Um, we've got lots of light copper pickaxes, but what can we sell these people? Granite pillars? Oh, brings me back. Right. Sell 10 of those. Right, has everyone got healed a bit? Yeah, everyone's got a bit healed. <laughs> That's... Right. Nice. Right. Um, yeah, so not everyone is super healed, but you know, we, we, we've got the health up generally, so... We've got plenty of slime as well, so I'm not too worried about that. Health levels, as it were. Right. I do want to link this up. Like so. Alright. I will link that up as well. Now. Get that sort of being done. Right. 10 gold. That should give us enough to all. 10 silver. That should get us enough to recruit a couple more dwarves. Alright. So. Fire dance are good. That's good. Slag fist. Yeah. Nope. Don't want that. Right. Rave of Heart, Snake Eyes, Energetic. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll have you. Not enough coins. Oh, you're 19. What have you got? Cast out. You're rubbish. Right, dismiss. What about you? Forgeborn, Battle Scarred, Fire Dancer. Right, I want you. How much do you cost? Oh, they cost 10. All right. You say you some garbage. What do you want mission wise? Let's say some stuff. Stuff that's not super valuable to me. But is of value to you. There's nothing in particular. You do like beetroots, but no. <laughs> uh, money, money, money. Money, money, money. I mean, I can sell some light pickaxes, I don't mind. Right, cool. Health levels are okay. I mean, they are eating up health potions and stuff. But they're going out of fashion. This is getting sort of done. We do need money. Money's like a new thing that we do need quite a lot of. Ah. Oh. Current limit of five, so why can I like why is it letting me have twenty? I don't understand. It seems it's lying to me. Right, let's just chill for a second and buy that good dwarf. Who was he? I don't mind. I don't mind. Not hire you. And this one here. 
Forge Bomb, Battle Scarred, Fire Dancer. That's good, right. So we're going to assign you to there, and boom, all right. Good, we're up to five dwarves. I should increase our economy, make things run a little faster. Just everything should be better, really. This cave's sort of coming along. We need to keep on drilling down. And drilling down. What's that? What's that? Nothing particularly clear. Uh, what did we get? Verdant Grove discovered. Good. Okay, cool. Right, that's good because that gives us all oh, technology wise. Uh, it's going to let us. Get that. And we've almost done it. So with 15 knowledge, we get up to um, what we need to do, which is the cogs. Uh, so we need to build cogs out of copper. Um, oh, we need steel plates. Okay, right. Steel plates out of copper. And I'm going to maintain. I'm going to say maintain like, I don't know. Um... 20. Across the mountain. I don't want to overwhelm myself with these things. And then, like... Same thing here. We haven't got any sheets yet, so we need to get those built. But we'll do... We'll, we'll get it done. We'll get it done. Then we'd start building tracks. Which means we kind of need to up the... We, we do need to find... Some more stuff, really. But we've got, like... We've got carts which is the most important thing but when we get cog drills so we need to get cog drills soon we'll get them soon though never you fear never you fear right we're just digging down here seeing what it's about yeah oh right right sweet so we've only got uh, we've got no mountain law at the moment. We do need a bit more mountain law because we need to get those. We need to get those things being built. So we need to make these and we make them out of copper sheets and we need to like maintain like twenty across the mountain. There. Okay, twenty across the mountain. All right, nice. So that means we can start putting in our very first rail stations. That everything like I planned it. That's not worked out so well. Actually, has that worked out so well? <laughs> Probably not. Hold on. That one worked out alright. I just not that one. Okay, well we'll worry about that. We'll sort this little fuck up out in a minute, right? Right, so we need some railway tracks. I'm going to build those out of copper ingots. And I want like 20 of those as well. So hopefully, a bit of luck, all this stuff is going to start getting built. Uh, we can't build railway tracks yet because we haven't got the technology to let's build railway tracks, but we can build elevator rails. So, like that. Be like so. Like so, like so, and then put that in there, like that, and like that, like that, and like that, like that, and like that, that will be fixed, I'll fix that, don't worry. And then like that, and like that. And then we just need to put a few carts in. going on there oh it's being attacked I thought it was some sort of disco going on in there in the dungeon right you die die rat die rat man don't attack my infirmary like that with impotence impotence no that'd be wrong not impotence something where you're like bold anyway right 
bit of a good start. I think the start's all right. We've got no fuel. Ugh, we'll deal with it. Oh, always the way. Always the way. Right. Nice. Okay. We've got a way to go. We're getting there, though. So if you enjoyed the content, please like, subscribe, ring the bell for notification. If you've already done that, it's most appreciated, as I always say. But I am honest, it is very much appreciated. So I will see you for the next thing that goes up on the channel. Thanks a lot. Farewell.